What's going on everybody? Alright, in this video I am going to show you how to create a bootable USB drive uh, for Kali Linux. So, and we're going to do this in Windows. So the first thing we need to do is get Rufus. Just go to Google, type Rufus. and download that bad boy. You can see I have it right there. Okay, so it's pretty straightforward. Go ahead and pitch your thumb drive in. I can, As you can see, I have one loaded right here. Go ahead and leave the default option for BIOS or UEFI. Set your volume label. This is the important part. This is where you want to select your ISO image of your Kali Linux. So if you go to Kali.org, go to the downloads, and you can download any of these appropriate ISO images. If it were me, I'd be going for this one right here. So just go ahead and download that as I have magically done right here. So I'm going to go ahead and select that image. And then all I need to do, click the start button. You might get this message, that's fine. Go ahead and click yes. And let it do its magic. Um. I've gotten this message every time. I've always just left it at the recommended option. I've never had any problems. Um, if you do have problems, follow the options and try the other one. Uh, this is just saying, hey, we're about to wipe your drive. Are you cool with that? Yep, I'm good with that. And there you go. As you can see, it's starting to write the all the files to the USB stick and allow it to be booted. So we'll go ahead and just let this run. All right, and we're done. You can see it's got our label here. We click close. One second here. drive and you can see right here there's our bootable disk rock and roll so that's all there is to it